Uh, six successes. <laughs> For the win. And okay. it's two in the explosion because I had to stand next to it. I'm not yeah. that good a shot. You, yeah, you got blown back. <laughs> so I got blown by the fist of tree. In fact, <coughs> there's a branch sticking through me. At the end, as the thing exploded, there's a branch that just impaled me. And maybe it's you got thrown against the tree, but you didn't slide down. <laughs> <laughs> I can't be. Oh. <laughs> but many of them. Uh, scurried away into the night after this flaming tree s- slammed down in front of them. Still, there's a, a group of them around Manteo. Manteo. Alrighty then. So, as I face off against them, I look down at the wound that the one gave me. Nice. Cover myself with it, <laughs> ready for war. Bring up my weapons, just as I'm about to lay into them. I hear the boy calling my name. Run into the <laughs> Yes. So I realize this is not the way to go. I'm going to run off towards the direction of the boy, throwing my knife at one of the ones that are to the side to distract them, and nail it, but run toward the boy, which is on the way to the, the, the fort. Right. As soon as I come into to contact with Payne, I'm going to reach in, shoulder tackle him, pick him up, and keep running towards the fort. Nice. And yell for the others to follow me. You got it? Okay. Um, so I guess that's mostly a defensive thing. I'm trying to get it to fit now. Because I think I have the resolution. It's uh, three defense, two offense. Two offense? Mm-hmm. What you needed. Great. Uh, so you're going to describe the resolution of the, the drinkers in the woods and getting up to the, the gate of the fort. Um, sure, sure. So um, I yell for the others to follow, and hopefully they will. Um, unfortunately, <laughs> very it, it's really okay with me if Brady does, doesn't he does, make it. He does the heroic right thing and pulls himself slowly <laughs> across the branch and off the tree. Knowing that he has to make it because he's part of the group that's going to save the colony. Uh, unfortunately, Emma's there since they came back together to help him, help kind of ha- carry him back to the to the thing. Um, uh, then he has pain over his shoulder and uh, signals uh, Liam. Is it? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, Liam to, to follow, and actually leads them through the flaming wreckage of the tree and jumps over like one of the larger log parts over the flame with the boy, giving pause to the things falling behind them because they're afraid of the fire and the, the, and the light. Um, and uh, hopefully scrambles into the, the fort proper. And that's not the only fire you see, because as you reach the fort, it is a, a, again illuminated in flame, this time from inside, and uh, standing silhouetted in the flame is uh, Tesla. Beating the heart drum. Boom. Boom. Of course she is. Boom. Boom. Uh, and there's howls not from behind you, but from inside the colony. Howls of your people twisting and shaping themselves into beasts. So, you, you now stand against Junlin the Drinker. This conflict will last no more than six minutes. Because 